excuse our tardiness. I would like to call the December the 10th, 2019 council meeting to order, and I'm going to ask the clerk to call the roll, please. Mr. Chambers? Here. Dr. Lee? Here. Mr. Mullins? Here. Ms. Walden? Here. Mr. Reynolds? Here. Ms. Schenholster? Here. All right, we do have a quorum present, so if you will at this time, please stand with me with, for the prayer and pledge. Merciful Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for this extraordinary season that we're about to approach. As we approach it, we ask that you continue to keep everyone safe and sound. We ask that everybody recognize why we're entering into this season and the real reason behind it. I thank you, merciful Father, for being merciful upon all of us. And I ask that you continue to put your hands around those that are less fortunate during this season. It is in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I am pleased to once again uh, be able to present certificates to two of our employees for going the extra steps to become better at the job they do for our citizens. So the first one that I'll be presenting tonight is to Mr. Mitchell Parrott. Parrot. Come on up, Mr. Mitchell. You ready for me? State of Georgia, Board of Examiners for Certification of Water and Wastewater Treatment Plant Operators and Laboratory Analysts certifies that Mitchell Ray Parrott, Jr., having given satisfactory evidence of the necessary qualifications as required by the laws of the State of Georgia, has been duly certified as a Wastewater Operator Class Three in the State of Georgia. Okay, the second one is to Scenario Millines. He didn't make it. Present. Yes, sir. Um, so we're going to ask Mr. Robert uh, Had. <laughs> I have senior moments, forgive me. <laughs> He's going to accept this one for Mr. Millines. State of Georgia Board of Examiners for Certification of Waste uh, of Water and Wastewater Treatment Plant Operators and Laboratory Analyst certifies that Scenario Damon Milan, having given satisfactory evidence of the necessary qualifications as required by the laws of the State of Georgia, has been duly certified as a wastewater laboratory analyst in the State of Georgia. Again, we are so thankful for our employees here at the city of Milledgeville who does such an outstanding job. And every week, I think when Mr. Hank sends out a text, I'm more and more proud to have Mr. Robert Haddon in place and overseeing things. Thank you so much for everything that you do, Mr. Robert. Uh, you all have all received a copy of the November 26, 2019 council meeting minutes. Are there any corrections? Do I hear a motion to adopt the minutes? Motion to adopt. Second. I'll ask the clerk to call the roll, please. Mr. Chambers? Aye. Dr. Lee? Aye. Mr. Mullins? Aye. Ms. Walden? Aye. Mr. Reynolds? Aye. Ms. Schenholster? Aye. All right, the minutes are approved. 
We don't have any old business, so I will move to new business and ask the clerk to read resolution R1912-37 by caption. To cancel the December 24th, 2019 regularly scheduled council meeting due to the Christmas holidays. All right, you have heard the resolution. Is there a motion? So moved. Second. Any discussion? I'll ask the clerk to please call the roll. Mr. Chambers? Aye. Dr. Lee? Aye. Mr. Mullins? Aye. Ms. Walden? Aye. Mr. Reynolds? Aye. Ms. Schenholster? Aye. Uh, I would like to ask the clerk to read resolution R1912-38 by caption. A resolution authorizing an extension to the previously adopted agreement with Cranston Engineering Group PC providing engineering services for Streetscape Phase 4 with the extended terms ending on January 31st, 2020. All right, you have heard the resolution. Is there a motion to adopt? I, I got a question about that. We've extended this twice. Um, is this going to be the last time that we're asked to extend it? Uh, I would certainly hope so. We did not anticipate having to uh, extend it this time, but uh, you all know that we've had some issues with that contractor, and uh, this extension is necessary to get the, the DOT uh, contract closed out. Mr. Jordan was in on a conference call today that I was not in, so he may be able to elaborate some on that. So. Well, I anticipate it being the, the last extension. Uh, I'm not sure as to what the outcome is going to be relative to the issues that we're having with the contractor, but uh, we had GDOT on the phone today, uh, as well as other folks that are involved in this, this whole process and I think we have a clear path forward to resolving uh, getting the project closed out. Uh, but we'll need to talk uh, uh, more in probably a closed session relative to potential litigation uh, as after the fact, after we, after we get the closed out. Right now we're trying to make sure that we have <coughs> crossed the T's and dotted the I's for getting our reimbursement for yes. what we what we've paid and what we yes. And that's and I, after the conference call today I I think everybody's on the same page to doing that. Okay. Uh, that was on that conference call. The contractor and, and his attorney were not on that call. So I'll keep you posted as we move forward. Are there any other questions? I move we approve. Second. <coughs> Clerk, call the roll, please. Mr. Chambers? Aye. Dr. Lee? Aye. Mr. Mullins? Aye. Ms. Walden? Aye. Mr. Reynolds? Aye. Ms. Schenholster? Aye. Right, the resolution is approved. Next, we have uh, the alcohol license renewals. If there is no objection, I would like to ask the clerk to please present the renewals in mask. And there is an, a, an addition that I put at your places in the council chambers. Uh, <coughs> Tipsy's Liquor, 1887 North Columbia Street, beer, wine, liquor, catering, uh, package to go. All American Quality Foods LLC food de uh, doing business as Food Depot, 1850 North Columbia Street, beer and wine, package to go. Jet Food Store number 61, 1740 North Columbia Street, beer and wine, package to go. CGDG LLC uh, doing business as Bollywood Tacos, 107 East Hancock Street for beer and wine, liquor, Sunday sales, and catering consumption on premises. HAC Incorporated doing business as Piggly Wiggly, 731 North Wayne Street, beer and wine, package to go. Stugard Light LLC doing business as Local Yokel Cafe, 117 Hancock Street for beer and wine, Sunday sales and, and catering, consumption on premises. 
Ruby Tuesdays Incorporated doing business. Well, it's Ruby Tuesdays, uh, 2440 North Columbia Street, beer, wine, liquor, Sunny sales, consumption on premises, Corson's Winery, 133 South Wayne Street, wine, package to go. Joiner and Ewing doing business as Amici's, 101 East Hancock Street, wine and liquor, Sunday sales, consumption on premises. Sodexo Management Incorporated, Main Dining Hall, 231 West Hancock Street for beer, wine, liquor, consumption on premises. Aldi Incorporated, 1978 North Climb Street for beer, wine, package to go. Progressive Restaurant Concepts, LLC, doing business as Pickle Barrel, 1892 North Climb Street, beer, wine, liquor, Sunday sales, catering, consumption on premises. MP Heritage Place, LLC, doing business as Marco's Pizza, 2910 Heritage Place, Place beer, wine, Sunday sales, consumption on premises. Beverage Company, 2, 901 West Montgomery Street, Street beer, wine, liquor, package to go. The Velvet Elvis LLC doing business as the Velvet Elvis, 113 Hancock Street, beer, wine, liquor, Sunday sales, catering, consumption on premises. Blackbird Coffee Incorporated doing business as Blackbird Coffee, 114 Hancock Street for beer and wine, Sunday sales, consumption on premises. Dollar Gen Corp LLC doing business as Dollar General number 1089, 1550 Columbia Street for beer and wine, package to go. Dahl Gen Corp LLC doing business as Dollar General number 9709, 207 Robertson Mill Road, beer wine package to go. Arya K Incorporating doing business as Discount Tobacco, 640 Wilkinson Street for beer wine package to go. BRG Beverages LLC doing business as Chili's Grill and Bar, 2596 Beer Wine. Liquor Sunday sales, consumption on premises. AUBM Incorporated doing business as The Brick, 136 West Hancock Street for beer, wine, liquor, Sunday sales and catering, consumption on premises. And that concludes the list. All right, you all have heard the renewals. Is there a motion to adopt in mass? Mosley approved. Second. And clerk, call the roll, please. Mr. Chambers? Aye. Dr. Lee? Aye. Mr. Mullins? Aye. Ms. Walden? Aye. Mr. Reynolds? Aye. Ms. Schenholster? Aye. Okay. Finally, we have appointments to make to our pension committee and city's appointment on the library board. All of these would be reappointments. I would like to nominate Vicki Waller as one of the two employees to the pension committee. Is there a motion to confirm this nomination? So moved. Second. Clerk, call the roll, please. Mr. Chambers? Aye. Dr. Lee? Aye. Mr. Mullins? Aye. Ms. Walden? Aye. Mr. Reynolds? Aye. Ms. Schenholster? Aye. The nomination is confirmed. Next, I would like to nominate Ms. Melba Henson Butts as the second employee appointment on the pension committee. Is there a motion to confirm this nomination? So moved. Second. Clerk, please call the roll. Mr. Chambers? Aye. Dr. Lee? Aye. Mr. Mullins? Aye. Ms. Walden? Aye. Mr. Reynolds? Aye. Ms. Schenholster? Aye. All right, the nomination is confirmed. Next, I would like to nominate uh, Mr. Robert Marshburn as the retired employee to the pension committee. Is there a motion to confirm this nomination? So moved. Second. Clerk, call the roll. Mr. Chambers? Aye. Dr. Lee? Aye. Mr. Mullins? Aye. Ms. Walden? Mr. Reynolds? Aye. Ms. Schenholster? Aye. The nomination is confirmed. Finally, we have two reappointments to the library board. Uh, I would like to nominate Rebel Pogue to the Twin Lakes 
Library Board, do I have a motion to confirm the nomination? So moved. Second. Clerk, please, clerk, please call the roll. Mr. Chambers? Aye. Dr. Lee? Aye. Mr. Mullins? Aye. Ms. Walden? Aye. Mr. Reynolds? Aye. Ms. Schenholster? Aye. The nomination is confirmed. And lastly, I would like to nominate Mr. Carl Casino to the Twin Lakes Library Board. Do I have a motion to confirm the nomination? Motion to approve. Second. Clerk, please call the roll. <coughs> Mr. Chambers? Aye. Dr. Lee? Aye. Mr. Mullins? Aye. Ms. Walden? Aye. Mr. Reynolds? Aye. Ms. Schenholster? Aye. The nomination is confirmed. This concludes the items on the agenda. Is there any further business to discuss? There's no other business to discuss. I would like to wish everyone a happy and safe holiday. Um, Merry Christmas from all of us on this board. Do I hear a motion to adjourn? So, so moved. Second. Meeting adjourned.